Hello, I'm Omar Osmani. I'm a consultant respiratory physician. I'm going to show you how to use what's called a pressurized meter dose inhaler, or PMDI. It is also sometimes known as a puffer. Getting your inhaler technique right is very important because it helps you manage symptoms better. It may take a few tries to feel comfortable using your inhaler, but it does get easier with practice. If your doctor or nurse has advised you or your child to use a spacer with your inhaler, watch our other videos on using a spacer. When you first get your inhaler, or if you haven't used it for five days or more, you will need to test it. To do this, take the cap off, shake the inhaler well, pointing the mouthpiece away from you, press the canister to release a puff into the air. How many test sprays you need to do will depend upon your inhaler so do check the instructions. This means it is now ready for use. Some PMDI inhalers have a dose counter. If yours has one, check it is not empty. Now, hold your inhaler upright and take the cap off. Check that there's nothing inside the inhaler mouthpiece. Shake the inhaler well. Sit or stand up straight and slightly tilt your chin up as it helps the medicine reach your lungs. The next steps all happen smoothly in one action. Breathe out gently and slowly away from the inhaler until your lungs feel empty and you feel ready to breathe in. Put your lips around the mouthpiece of the inhaler to make a tight seal. Start to breathe in slowly and steadily and at the same time press the canister on the inhaler once. Continue to breathe in slowly until your lungs feel full. Take the inhaler out of your mouth and with your lips closed, hold your breath for up to 10 seconds or for as long as you comfortably can. Then breathe out gently away from your inhaler. If you've been prescribed a second puff, wait 30 seconds to a minute and shake the inhaler again. Then repeat the steps. When you have finished, Replace the cap on the inhaler. If you've used an inhaler that contains steroids, rinse your mouth with water and spit it out to reduce the chance of side effects. For more tips on using your inhaler, why not watch our other videos?